One of the major stumbling blocks to starting up companies and the growth of existing businesses in the private sector has been access to medium and long-term financing. The Ghana Private Sector Development Fund, GPSDF, was established with funds from the Italian government to help address this problem. Now known as the Ghana Private Sector Development Facility, it has granted concessional loans to companies and is making considerable impact. One such company is Faster Limited in Accra, manufacturers of concrete products. We had a facility uh, from Ghana Private Sector Fund through Merchant Bank, and it has helped us transform our company by 25% more, uh, giving us new products, uh, acquiring more land for our new machines, engaging more skilled and unskilled labor as well. So it has been a complete transformation of our company. The quarry division of Sarobi Limited at Atabazi Junction in the central region has also seen its fortunes improve with a concessional loan from the Ghana Private Sector Development Facility, GPSDF. It has only recently installed the equipment it imported. Right now what we are doing is testing it. When we finish, when we do the blasting, fresh blasting, then we have to raise the production, at least near to double what we are having before. After the initial installation, we started with the trials. The trials were successful and we, we brought in more workers. In, uh, we increased we increase the, uh, the workforce from 10 to 24. With a loan from the Ghana Private Sector Development Facility, Master Mix Studios at Nungwa near Accra also had its long-cherished dream come true when it transformed its studio into an international standard one with modern music recording equipment, among others. We expanded our studio base where we are now, which is an international level studio. We got a PA out of it. And out of the PA, we've been able to do quite a number of international jobs, like the opening ceremony for Cannes 2008, um, the CNN Journalist Awards. And these are programs that they would have probably brought in equipment from outside of Ghana, maybe South Africa, maybe Europe, to have done these kind of programs. But again, this facility has helped a local company to have the kind of equipment required for that kind of program and we've delivered it and that was a Ghanaian you know based thing that was done so it has really helped us to expand for us to grow and get into where our vision and dream is. Golden Web Limited at Shrapatre in Kumasi, the Ashanti regional capital, another beneficiary of the GPSDF is into the processing and production of coconut and palm kernel oil. It acquired a discontinuous refinery plant for vegetable oil, among others, with its loan. The company has since been making strides. With the expansion going into refinery, we are able to use other oil seeds like sunflower, soy beans, or cotton seed. In fact, we can use any oil seed so far as there's market for the final products. And also, it has helped expand our employment base. It has uh, created more uh, avenue for wealth creation. And uh, above all, we have gained from transfer of technology. Quali Park Limited, which is into the manufacturing of plastic industrial packaging, purchased toggle injection molding machines with its loan from the GPSDF. These have greatly enhanced the fortunes of the company. At the beginning, we had about uh, 20 people. Um, we were about five in the administration. We were about uh, 15 uh, as uh, factory hands. Uh, today, we count around uh, 200 between operators, supervisors, and technicians, and we have about 20 in the administration. 
So you can imagine what sort of uh, impact that has uh, affected our uh, employment. So we have created more uh, job and our turnover has actually more than doubled. Gabling Company Limited, located in Accra, which has also accessed the GPSDF facility, is engaged in the processing of cocoa beans and cocoa products. It acquired a filling machine, a semi-automatic string wrapping, a generator set to ensure uninterrupted production to meet demand, and a van to facilitate delivery. Before, we were producing barely three tons in a month. But ever since we got the equipment, it has increased to between five to ten tons. Even though that is mainly because we don't have the working capital to, to boost out to our full capacity. Kingsman Modern Auto Company, a tire services center in Accra, used its loan through Carl Bank to acquire equipment for tire-related operations at its quick fit tire center. Because of the efficiency of the machines, every staff wanted to work on this environment. And it has increased the workforce too, because people are determined to work faster and more. Tongu Fruits and Stay Sweet Limited in the Volta region also accessed the GPSDF facility. They purchased fruit processing equipment with the facility. A successful test run was carried out recently and all is set for production of fruit juice to begin. I'm very excited about this project. This cooperation between the Ghana government and the Italian government is a very laudable one and is very beneficial to the communities. This community especially is going to benefit tremendously because the establishment of this factory here will encourage a lot of uh, people to go into pineapple production and then also into mango production. We expect at least 2,000 people to be involved in pineapple and mango production in the Hohoe and Pando districts. That is going to be very beneficial to the communities. At present, we have employed about 48 women here. Our employment here, direct employment, is going to be over 75. And these people will be able to have enough money to send their children to school. And also, some of them will be able to do a lot more building projects and other projects. We shall also be contributing to the communities in which we serve. And I think that we have to thank the Ghana government and the Italian government for making this very possible. Mountain View Limited is another beneficiary of the GPSDF facility. The company purchased a reach stacker and spreaders with its loan and this has helped it to provide improved Steve Doran services to ship owners at the port. These and many more Ghanaian companies have reaped considerable benefits from the concessional loans they accessed from the Ghana Private Sector Development Facility, including expansion and the provision of more jobs. Mm -hmm.